Welcome to Star Technology 5G. In the last video, we studied how to change the LEDs pattern using PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. In today video I will show you how to rotate the LEDs using PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Let's start the video. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G and click on the bell icon. Project, how to rotate LEDs. In this project, LEDs are connected to the port D of a PIC 16 F877 microcontroller and we are using the current sourcing mode of the LEDs. The microcontroller is operated from an 8 MHz crystal. When power is applied to the microcontroller, or when the microcontroller is reset, the LED starts rotating from left to right and when it will reach at the end it will start rotating from right to left. Here is the circuit diagram we are using in our project. It is PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Pin number 1 is master reset. Port D are interfaced with LEDs and we are using the current sourcing mode of the LED and the value of the resistor is 290 ohm. Pin numbers 13 and 14 are the interface with an 8 MHz crystal and 22 PF capacitors are connected with the crystal. Pin number 11 and 32 are connected with positive 5 volts. Pin number 12 and 31 are connected with ground volt. Let draw this circuit in Proteus. Circuit is ready now we will write its code in micro CPIC.
Here is the window where we can write the code. I already wrote the code otherwise video gets very long I will copy the code. And I will paste it here. Now I will define the code. Unsigned char m and n. Here we define a variable. Void delay unsigned char. Time. Here we are creating a delay function with variable name time. Unsigned int y, z. These are two variables. We are using these variables in for loop. For y is equal to 0 y is less than time and increment the y. For z is equal to 0 z is less than 500 and increment the z. Void main is the main function of the C language. TRISD equals 0 x 0 0 semicolon. That is hex value. This instruction set port D as output port. While 1 is an endless loop. M is equal to 0 x 0 1. That is initial value of the variable. For n equals 0, n less than 8, and increment the value of n. This for loop repeat 8 times. Port D equals M. It will send the value of M to port D. The initial value of M is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. After that, we call the delay function and we give the value of 150. This delay is the time for how long we need to turn on LED. M equals M rotate left by 1. This instruction rotate M to left side. With 1 bit. Now the value of M is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0. Next step the value of N is 1. And it will send the value of M to port D and again call delay function. And again rotate the value of M. Now the value of M is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0. Now it will send this data to port D. After completing 8 step it will exit from the for loop. First we rotate left side now we rotate right side. Next the value of M is 0x80. It is hex value. Its binary code is 1000000000. For n equals 0, n less than 8, and increment the value of n. This for loop repeat 8 times. Port D equals M. It will send the value of M to port D. After that, we call the delay function and we give the value of 150. This delay is the time for how long we need to turn on LED. M equals M rotate right by 1. That is same for loop we used for rotating the left side but thus for loop rotate led right side. It will repeat the code again and again. Because we are using while one loop as the endless loop. Now we will create the hex file. Just click on the build icon. Finished successfully. File is created now we will load hex file into the microcontroller. Double click on the microcontroller. Select the hex file. OK. And click on the run simulation. You can see LED get turned on and off and rotate form left to right. After turning on and off all LEDs it will start rotating from right to left and repeat the same step. If you have any problem with the code let me know in comments. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G. And keep watching Star Technology 5G.